Hey guys, today is day 17 of my Christmas Horror Challenge and today I'm going to do a double feature of two films uh, released uh, from SRS Cinema uh, earlier, uh, I think it's last year, actually late last year. Um, one's from 2003 and one's from 2006 and I'm going to talk about the Psycho Santa 1 and 2 double feature. So, show you the spine and then the back. So, yeah, um, <laughs> these two are uh, definitely not the greatest films in the world. Um, I actually like part two more than part one, but I'm going to get into that in a second here. So, so the first uh, Psycho Santa is from 2003, 72 minutes, not rated, uh, directed by Peter Kier. Um, actually, it's, uh, I see I see a, a big typo in the back here, but I'll avoid uh, saying what it says. Uh, while en route to a holiday gathering, young Ron teases his wife about the legend of a backwoods Santa with an axe to grind. However, when the legend comes to life, the Christmas bash turns into a holiday bloodbath. Um, good premise. I definitely enjoyed the plot of the story. Unfortunately, a lot of the kills were off screen, um, but there was still a lot of blood and gore and guts in it, so it had that going for it. Uh, the acting is terrible. <laughs> um, the lighting wasn't that great, wasn't the greatest either. I'll tell them that much, but you know, going into it, it's not it's not a you know big production. Obviously, it's very low budget. Um, didn't care for it very much. Uh, Psycho Santa Two, a uh, killer in a Santa Claus suit returns to the quiet town that burned him, and along the way finds his son and makes the Christmas killing a family affair. This one was a little bit better. Um, Again, some of the lighting in the early on in the film was terrible. The opening sequence of the, the movie itself, I guess it was supposed to be these two burglars breaking in to someone's house and they end up going into this room that's um, locked up and they, <laughs> they, they get what they bargained for when they walk into that, to that, um, to that room. Um, but basically that particular room that they filmed it in was actually the apartment, the same apartment that most of the movie takes place in. So it was just like, okay. So I don't know if, it, I don't know if that's that, I think the specific scene was, or it was before the film started. Because obviously the way that the movie ends, I don't know. But then again, I have no idea. But I like the tie-in with with the son and and everything going, and then the cops get involved and they think that that since you know the this Santa dude died, they think his son is doing all the killing. But I'll, I'll leave you guys up to to watch it to see what the twist is and everything. Um, you can we can watch both of these uh, for free on Tubi right now. Apparently, I just found out that yesterday. So. Check them out if you'd like. Like I said, I think the second one is a little bit better than the first. I'm not going to say it's, you know, the greatest film in the world, but it's it's a little bit better. You actually have good, uh, there's a decapitation scene that's pretty cool. Well, not cool, I guess brutal is the word I should use. Um, someone loses their hand with a machete. That was pretty gruesome. A lot of stabbing. Your typical horror film slasher. So, yeah, anyway, definitely recommend the second one over the first one. But then again, don't take my recommendation seriously because this, this is very low budget unless you like that kind of thing. So, uh, if you guys enjoy it well enough, I believe they still might have a few copies available on their website. So, you can go to srscinema.com and you can. Uh, Definitely grab that. Uh, there's quite a few other films by SRS Cinema that I would definitely recommend over this one. Um, like Little Cory Gory, that one I believe is still available. 
um, you know, just check it out. Check it out. So that's all I got for you guys today. I will catch you guys tomorrow for day 18 and probably I might do another up update haul because I have other things I have to show off. But I've been doing little short videos here and there. I'm not going to put everything together all at once because that would be a very long video. I like to keep it under 20 minutes, maybe 15 or so. That was weird. Anyway, catch you guys later. Bye.